Get out, son. Hello and what is up my dear Yu-Gi-Tuber friends, my name is Atticus Schaefer and I am coming at you today with a very long awaited product opening video. So you guys, I want to sincerely apologize, I meant to get this video out months ago back when this product first came out, but unfortunately a automatic setting went awry in my editing computer and all of my storage space was eaten up. Go figure. So it took me a little bit of time to figure out what the heck was going on with that. I finally did, and now I'm able to make videos again, which you guys have been able to see through the Escape from Tarkov and Last of Us Part 2 videos. But now, for those of you who love Yu-Gi-Oh! like I do, and especially product opening, I now present to you not one, but two display cases of the Ghost from the Past Yu-Gi-Oh! product. <gasps> Special. Uh, I'm very excited about this set, and uh, you know what? It's, we've been waiting long enough. Let's go ahead and get into the opening. Alrighty, my dear friends, here we are. We've got the mat out, we've got all the product out, and this has been a couple months in the waiting, for me at least, and I am so excited to be able to share with you my opening of Ghosts from the Past. It's actually really funny. I've been playing Yu-Gi-Oh! long enough that I remember back in the day when you could go to Sneak Peaks, and they were hosted by Upper Deck, and essentially Sneak Peaks used to be regional, so you'd have one day where you'd get the product and have a lot of fun, the next day, you would play in the tournament, and you could use the product, and, uh, yeah, it was insane. I remember, I remember, uh, my buddy, who I would always go with, he pulled first edition Ghost Rare Stardust Dragon, and at the time, it was like, whoa, we're the coolest people in the room. <laughs> so, anyway, Blast from the Past, I'm really excited about this set, uh, if anything, just for the sheer value of the collectability of the Ghost Rares, as well as, I think, that the, um, Silent Night... Uh, what you call it, archetype, uh, in this, I think it's pretty cool, especially because I'm a Christian, I thought that was a cool, you know, archetype that they made, I wish they would have made it better, but it is what it is, <laughs> um, oh, so real quick, anyway, I saved you guys some time, uh, off camera, I opened up the cases of these boxes, so in each case, uh, or not case, display, um, there are five of these, uh, and then inside of each one of these is three packs of five cards. So, do the math. <laughs> and that's how much product we have here. So I'm going to go ahead and set this up here. Make it look all pretty. Uh, no, that's going to cause a shadow. I'm putting it over here. Alrighty, kids. Here we go. I'm very excited. Let's have some fun opening up some product and see what we can get. Hopefully we can get a ghost rare. Especially after all the time waiting. It would be nice to have one. Okay, so... Time Thief Startup. Focus, camera. Focus. Not... Okay, there we go. Time Thief Startup. Sunseed Twin. Sun Avalon Bloom. Heretic Seal of Reflection. And the new Necroz monster. Necroz of Arid Bear. That's pretty cool. Oop. Let's find the sweet spot. New camera, you guys. I'm still learning how it works. Okay. Interesting. Sweet. All right. First pack. Done. Come on, Ghost Rare. <clears throat> I forget where the Ghost Rare is. I can't remember if it's in the front or the back. All right. Apologies, you guys. Not sure why. Camera's wigging out like this. Might be because it's autofocus. There we go. Resonator Engine. Heretic Seal of Convocation. Maldoche Pudding Sessor. Cosmojo. And Starry Night Sky. Mmm. Guys, hold on just a sec. I'm going to play around with my uh, camera settings here. Hopefully I can figure out what where the focal point is supposed to be. Just give me a minute. Okay, played around with my camera settings for a little bit. That's the whole point of uh, of how you do stuff in real life, right, guys? 
you learn as you go. And this camera's a bit new to me, uh, so I was, this is the first video I'm, I'm doing with it. It's christening the camera, so appreciate your patience with that. I think I figured out how this sort of thing works, so let's see what we can see with the rest of our pack opening. Now, if only the packs would open. <laughs> uh, okay, here we go. Recover. Molten conductor field, or conduction field. Seems to be for Volvo Monsters. Interesting. Fairy Tale Raka. Raka. Sunvine Healer. And Heretic Seal of the Heavenly Spheres. Spicy. Alright. Metal Foe Stealing. Another Mount Oh, Mount Doce Pudding Cess. Time Thief Winder, Dragoodini Phalanx, and Lovell Archer. Uh, if anything, you guys, I think it's so cool how they brought back uh, certain archetypes and uh, really, you know, give them that, that hollow upgrade of deliciousness. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I uh, I like seeing that. I like when Konami does that. It's always fun to go back and be able to reminisce about different archetypes and stuff like that. Okay, so mask change, royal prison, backup secretary, metal foals, gold driver, and knee Shadal genius. I think this is the new, or at the time, the new Shadal from a couple months ago. Interesting. Tasty. Okay. Come on, Ghost Rare. And come on, Starry Night stuff, just for my own interest. Time Thief Flyback. Hyo Zan Ryu. I got the structure deck that this first came in. It was awesome. It's so cool to see this again. Uh, Cosmojo. Sun Sea Genus Loki and Sunvine Thrasher. Give them the plants. Tasty. Okay. Yu Gi Oh! <clears throat> Flyback. Laval Volcano Handmaiden. Fairy Tale Tales, Starry Night Blast, and Starry Night Starry Dragon. Ooh, pretty. Quote, boss monster, end quote. <laughs> this one's bent, that scares me. Watch, this is the one that has a ghost rare in it, but the ghost rare is going to be jacked. I hope not. Come on, I believe in you. All right. Heretic Seal of Supremacy. Heretic Dragon of Tefnuit. Heretic Sun Dragon Overlord. Sunvine Healer. And Time Thief Adjuster. Interesting. She looks like she's having a strange day. Alright, Galaxy Eyes Cypher Blade Dragon, 3 level 9s. Metal Foes Mithrilium, or Myth Mithrilium, Mithril. Artifact Durandal, Mist Valley Baby Rock, and Starry Night Ceremony. Mmm. Special. The unfortunate thing that I find, you guys, is, you know, sometimes in, uh, in sets like this, you, uh, you don't get to get a full deck in one go. And I really wanted to buy to uh, build the whole Starry Night deck just for poops and giggles. Salvage. Bezel Ship Retrograde. And Hell Shadal Hollow. What the deuce. Yeah. Neener. Wow, my focus is just terrible. What the heck is going on? Alright, it's it shows it down here, I guess. Definitely have a ways to go with uh the old autofocus. 
Interesting. Sun Avalon Island thingy. Dragunity. Oblique. Heretic Dragon of Eset. Middle Foes Fusion. And Thestalos the Mega Monarch. That's cool, actually. I have the dark one and the light one? Eh. Interesting. That's cool. I like it. Collecting. Collection. Collecting. I took two words and combined them into one. Mask change. Maldoche Fresh Sistart. Gear Town. Metal Foes Volflame and Dragoonity Arma Gram. Like the cracker. Pretty. I really don't even remember what is value in here other than the ghost rares. So, I don't know if we're plessing or not, but whatever. We're having fun. Isn't that the name of the game? Oh, Jama Country! Maldoche, Mask Change 2, and Heretic Seal of Creation. For creating your heretic dragons of heresy. I always give it that little shake. That was the skill. Ooh. This one's cool. Dark Requiem. Xyz dragon. I feel like I keep having to. There we go. Dark Requiem. Time Thief Hack. Hacker. Overlord, Seal of Banishment, and Sun Avalon Dryanome. Plants. Give me the plants. Alright. Arc Brave Dragon. Interesting. Never seen this card before ever. Another Metal Foes guy. Phantom Knight's Fog Blade. Gigantes. That's actually kind of funny. I remember when this card was played long before the Rock Stun deck came out. This it had its own purposes back in the day. And Meteor Black Comet Dragon, which is apparently made out of Red Eyes monsters and dragons. Interesting. Hmm. Potential uh, Waking the Dragon target. I don't know what it does, but I'll just say that it is. Makes me sound like I know more than I do. About competitive play. Alright, Metal Foes counter. Yoink. Come on, camera. Boop. Metal Foes counter. Time Thief Retrograde. Sunvine Shrine. Galaxy Eye Cypher Blade. And Starry Night Balefire. Give them the Balefire. Interesting. They have so many cards in this specific archetype, and yet... You're not able to pull them all. Splash Mage. Little Falls Silvered. Sunseed Shadow. Dragonity Draft. And Cypher X Dragon. Interesting. Special. What's the over under that we get a Ghost Rare, friends? Tell me. Tefnuit. Regulator. Photon Thrasher. Nofos Mithrilium. And Red Supernova Dragon. Requires three tuners. Interesting. Woo! Tackle Crusader. This dude's art is awesome. It reminds me of, uh... Okay, showing my other nerdy side of video games. It reminds me of Star Wars The Force Unleashed 1, when you have to go to the junk planet and fight all the junk golems. Yeah, that's what this reminds me of. Who remembers that? Any gamers out there, do you remember the deliciousness that was Force Unleashed 1? Buster Dragon, Miss Valley Baby Rock, the Monarchs Erupt, and Dragoonity Knight Arad, <clears throat> Arad Bear. Another Sun Avalon, little tiny tree of cuteness that wrecks you, supposedly. Xyz Burst, Update Jammer, 
Hyo Zen Ryu, and Starry Night Arrival. Cool. Come on, Ghost Rare. Cypher Blade. Metal Foes Mithrilium. Mithrilium. Love of all things sacred focus. I belched into the camera. That means it's been christened. Durandal. Miss Valley Baby Rock. And Vampire Voivode? Interesting. I didn't know this was coming out. This artwork is very interesting. It's, it, well, number one, nowadays, it reminds us of uh, Resident Evil Village. But I remember when the first um, structure decks came out. And uh, the vampire cards and the zombie one were really cool looking. Alright, Heretic Dragon of Autumn, Redoer, Counter, Miracle Synchro Fusion, and Arm Dragon level 10! I actually have the new Arm Dragon card, so it's really cool to have the classic with me now. That's cool. I, uh, I remember back when Arm Dragons were super good. You'd bring out level 7 and laugh at your opponent, because at the time there was really nothing to do. Nothing that could be done, except maybe beat over it. <clears throat> That's cool. Love the Maldoche cards, too. Maldoche Chateau. Yoink. Salmon Great Falco. Metal Foes Fusion. Dragon Knight Draco Equeste. Remember when this card came out? And evenly matched! I'll take that. I know that's somewhat valuable. Woo! Evenly matched. At least there's one. That's something. Plus the other cool little collectible thingies. Makes me happy. Time Thief Perpetua? Or Perpetua. Depending on how you say it. Supremacy. Starry Night Astel. Sunvine Maiden. And Starry Night Flamel. I'm going to say it like that, just because it sounds fancier. Cool. I want to make Starry Nights. I want to make a Starry Night deck profile. Hit the like button if you'd like to see it. I'll try to make it happen. Photon Thrasher. Metal Foes Mithrilium. Metal Foes Combination. Ojama Country. And another evenly matched! Ha! That's cool. Got dual wield evenly matched. That's awesome. Woo! I have my secret rares, but I don't mind taking the ultras and sticking them in the old binder. Backup secretary. Middle foes gold driver. Time thief flyback. Laval volcano handmaiden. And another necroz of arid bear. Oh, I get it. Necroz of arid bear. And then you have dragoonity. I get it. I get it. That's what they're... That's what they're mimicking. Fairy tale tales. Starting us off. Starry Night Blast. Heretic. Redoer. And Laval Archer. And we're nearing the end of this glorious display opening. Glorious is a relative term. In this case, but that's okay. Middle Foes Counter. Time Thief Retrograde. Sunvine Shrine. It's deciding to focus on my thumb. Interesting. Cypher Blade and Dragoonity Whirlwind. Alright. Second to last pack. Second to last one, friends. Splash Mage, Metal Foe Silvered, Sun Seed Shadow, Dragoonity Draft, and Shooting Star TGX. Pretty. <laughs> Alright, my friends. Last pack. Last pack of the deliciousness that is Ghost from the Past. Can we pull a Ghost Rare? Tefnuit. Regulator. Photon Thrasher, Mithrilium, and Raid Raptor Tribute Lanius. 
Can't remember if this was sought after or not. But, on that note, alas, we are ghost rareless. But we got some other really cool stuff, in my opinion. All right, you guys. Well, uh, the, it definitely was not what I expected as far as the product opening. Of course, everybody wants to be able to pull a Ghost Rare. I know that many of you out there were lucky enough to be able to pull several different types of Ghost Rares, whether it be Dark Magician all the way up to Firewall Dragon and Black Luster Soldier. Fantastic for you. I think that's so awesome. It wasn't quite my luck today, but it's okay. I love the collectability of a lot of this set. It's really cool to get some um, new reprints of older cards that I remember back when I was first getting into Yu-Gi-Oh! As well as cool new archetypes like Starry Night. I know Starry Night isn't the most competitive deck out there, but I think it's cool. Uh, I personally would love to build it and see what I can do with it. But guys, for those of you who love the Yu-Gi-Oh! videos, please be sure to subscribe to the channel. Be sure to share this video if you like it. Give it a thumbs up and continue to support me here on the YouTubes. Uh, I'm actually going to be doing more Yu-Gi-Oh! product. There's some stuff that's been long awaited. I have not been in a bunch of tournaments lately simply because of needing to figure out a bunch of different things with my Twitch business and uh, as well as YouTube as well and I've uh, been trying to grow that. But what's the best way to grow your YouTube channel? Make videos. So I'm definitely going to be doing that. For those of you who love Yu-Gi-Oh! I've got deck profiles planned, more product openings, and even some mystery packs that I found at my local antique mall that I'm going to be doing an uh, opening for here on the channel. So be sure to stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I hope you enjoyed the video. God bless you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Atticus Schaefer, signing off. Dovid Zenya.